Come on, man. Holyfield's corner needs to really get to their man after this round. They need to treat him after that knockdown. They also need to give him some sound advice. What's the advice you give him? Well, first of all, if they're going to get the chance to get to him, he better move his head. But the advice I would give him is, hey, you go out this next round and you kill some time. Tie him up a little bit right from the beginning. Don't worry about losing the early part of the fight or the early part of the round. Just get yourself back together. Well-targeted two-punch combo by Evander Holyfield. Good defensive guard now by Evander Holyfield. You can see he's trying to score up top, but off the mark there. Holyfield's a seasoned pro, and old pros tend to fall into the same pattern. Nothing has changed with him stylistically since he's been knocked down in this fight. Well, that falls right into that pattern or that cliche where old dogs can't be taught new tricks. Well, right now, he's going to have to come up with a trick or two, maybe, to survive this moment. Well-targeted combination by Evander Holyfield. Good defense upstairs to stay away from that offensive assault. Good fighting, snapping shot by George Foreman. It's hard to believe that at this late stage of the fight, both men are able to give as much as they are giving. This is how you find out where somebody is brilliant. This is where you find out where somebody is special and does extraordinary things by pushing them to a difficult place. George Foreman's not just loading up. He's landing combination punches like he did right there. He needs to improve the accuracy a little bit. That was comical by George Foreman. That's great stuff. He fires one right back after taking one. Gotta love the work by George Foreman. Holyfield's putting forth that hard work he did in training. There it is! He was able to get up and continue on last time. Now he goes down again. So two guys who everybody thought had no chance of hearing the final bell now.